solve the equation with floor, and fractional parts of x. The floor function is the function, that takes as input a real number x, and gives as output the greatest integer less than or equal to x. For example, the floor of 3.2 is 3. The fractional part function is a function, that gives the fractional part of x, by subtracting the greatest integer less than x, from x. For example, the fractional part of 3.2 is 0.2. Similarly, the floor of negative 2.6 is negative 3. The fractional part of negative 2.6 is 0.4. As negative 2.6, minus negative 3, is 0.4. The floor of 2 is 2, as 2 is the greatest integer less than or equal to 2. So the fractional part of 2 is 0. Note that, the fractional part is greater than or equal to 0, and is less than 1. We let x equal n plus f where n is the greatest integer less than or equal to x, and f is the fractional part of x, which is always greater than or equal to 0, and is less than 1. Then the floor of x in the given equation, is denoted by n. And the fractional part of x in the given equation, is denoted by f. So the original equation can now be written as, 176, times n plus f, minus 4n squared, minus 88f squared, equals 2023. Expand and rearrange the equation, we have, 4n squared, minus 176n, plus 88f squared, minus 176f, plus 2023, equals 0. 4n squared, minus 176n, can be written as, 4 times n squared, minus 44n. 88f squared, minus 176f, can be written as, 88 times f squared, minus 2f. Then plus 2023, equals 0. To complete the squares, we add 4 times 22 squared, and add 88 to the equation. Of course, we also need to add negative 4 times 22 squared, and add negative 88, so that the equation still hold. So the equation becomes, 4 times n squared, minus 44n, plus 22 squared, plus 88 times f squared, minus 2f, plus 1, plus 2023, minus 4 times 22 squared, minus 88, equals 0. n squared, minus 44n, plus 22 squared, is equal to, n minus 22 all squared. f squared, minus 2f, plus 1, is equal to, f minus 1 all squared. 2023, minus 4 times 22 squared, minus 88, equals negative 1. So we have, 4 times n minus 22 all squared, plus 88 times f minus 1 all squared, minus 1 equals 0. We label this as equation 1. As n is an integer, so n minus 22, is also an integer. If n minus 22 all squared, is greater than or equal to 1, then 4 times n minus 22 all squared, minus 1, must be greater than or equal to 3. Then from equation 1, we know that, 88 times f minus 1 all squared, is less than or equal to negative 3. This is impossible. So this implies that, n minus 22 must equal 0. That is, n equals 22. Then from equation 1, we know that, 88 times f minus 1 all squared, minus 1 is equal to 0. So f minus 1 all squared, equals 1 over 88. So f equals 1 plus or minus 1 over root of, 88, which is equal to, 1 plus or minus root of, 22, over 44. As f is less than 1, so f equals 1 minus root of, 22, over 44. We have found n and f. So x equals n plus f, which is equal to 22, plus 1 minus root of, 22, over 44. Which is 23, minus root of, 22, over 44. This is the only solution of the given equation.